Hello guys, this is Danica here again with the Museum Features Series. Today I want to go over a couple details about this 1965 Husky 600. Now first I want to talk a bit about the Husky Company. Husky was a Canadian snowmobile manufacturer. They were originally started in Ontario in 1962-1963. Now, our sled here is pretty accurate to how it would have been in the 1960s. The only part that has been refurbished is the hood here by Precision Collision in West Lock. But the rest is, again, you know, pretty accurate to what you would have seen at the time. Now, this sled was very regularly advertised as being for both work and play. For some, a sled like this might be used to find, you know, hard to reach places for loggers. But for others, a sled like this might be used for family pleasure. Maybe they're ice fishing, maybe they're just out for a joy ride. Uh, it was advertised as being able to fit four children or three adults, so certainly a lot of people could fit. Now, one of the big selling points for a Husky like this was its portability. You'll see here that the tractor side and the ski side can be separated in the middle here which meant that the sled itself could be put into the trunk of a large car, which is pretty different from today. You know, if you have a sled, it's likely you need a trailer or a large truck box to actually get the machine anywhere. So this was a massive selling point at the time. Now the model we have here is a 600, so it did come a little later. So this machine itself was not manufactured in Ontario. Instead, it was manufactured in Pointe Claire, Quebec. So that's where the factory was moved to after the company was sold to Johnson Wire Works in the mid 1960s. And the factory there did have about 100 people working there. So it was a pretty big factory. And that is where our particular sled comes from. To check out this piece of machinery and more, feel free to stop by the Westlock Pioneer Museum. We are open five days a week, Tuesday to Saturday, 10 to five, and we hope to see you soon.